Hey, hey everyone. I wish I could see all y'all lovely faces. You'll have to tolerate mine for a bit, but can work on your kindness and patience. <laughs> all right, we have chapter 35 today. And after reading about the judgment of nations yesterday in chapter 34, today we get to see God bring upon beautiful restoration. During the Messiah's future reign on earth, the whole world will become a flourishing garden. Let's have a look. The wilderness and desert will be glad, and the Arabah will rejoice and blossom like the crocus or a rose. It will blossom profusely and rejoice with rejoicing and shout of joy. The glory of Lebanon will be given to it, the majesty of Carmel and Sharon. They will see the glory of the Lord, the majesty of our God. Encourage the exhausted and strengthen the feeble. Say to those with anxious heart, take courage and fear not. Behold, your God will come with vengeance. The recompense of God will come, but he will save you. Then the eyes of the blind will be opened, and the ears of the deaf will be unstopped. Then the lame will leap like a deer, and the tongue of the mute will shout for joy. For waters will break forth in the wilderness and streams in the Arabah, or the desert regions. The scorched land will become a pool, and the thirsty ground springs of water. In the haunt of jackals, its resting place, grass becomes reeds and rushes. A highway will be there, a roadway, and it will be called the Highway of Holiness. I want to get on that. The unclean will not travel on it, but it will be for him who walks that way, and fools will not wander on it. So no fools either? Definitely sign me up. Oh, there's too many, isn't there? <laughs> no lion will be there, nor will any vicious beast go up on it. These will not be found there, but the redeemed will walk there. And the ransomed of the Lord will return and come with joyful shouting to Zion, with everlasting joy upon their head. They will find gladness and joy, and sorrow and sighing will flee away. All right, well, today's hymn to reflect upon in prayer is My Faith Looks Up to Thee by Ray Palmer, originally published in 1883. My faith looks up to thee, thou Lamb of Calvary. Savior divine, now hear me while I pray. Take all my guilt away. Oh, let me from this day be wholly thine. May thy rich grace impart strength to my fainting heart. My zeal inspire. As thou hast died for me, oh, may my love to thee, pure, warm, and changeless be, a living fire. While life's dark maze I tread and griefs around me spread, be thou my guide. Bid darkness turn to day. Wipe sorrow's tears away, nor let me ever stray from the side. When ends life's transient dream, when death's cold, sullen stream shall over me roll, blessed Savior, then in love, fear and distrust remove. O oh, bear me safe above a ransomed soul. Dear Lord, we acknowledge that salvation is provided fully and freely by grace to those who place their faith in you. Thank you for the grace that saves ungodly sinners like us. We come before you to celebrate your grace in the power of the gospel, which has captured our souls for eternal life and our hearts for joyful worship. We come as undeserving sinners who have simply trusted in you. We look to you alone for righteousness and reconciliation. Please keep working in our lives, helping us to take you at your word without any doubt, confessing and setting aside our own sins and selves. We praise you for the greatness of your mercy, grace, love, and pure goodness that will bring us to glory through Christ our Savior. Finally, we want to pray collectively for the California recall situation. I think I need to be careful what I say on this platform here, but we just ask that your will be carried out. And unless your will is to continue in chastisement and punishment, we'd like to ask that you protect the results from any illegal tampering and falsifying. We're sorry for how people in California have treated you, but we seek to see righteousness and laws that honor your name restored. Please receive our worship as we bring it before you in Jesus' name. Amen. Thank you, guys. Hope you have a good day today. Stay in faith. Don't worry. God bless you. Take care.